Okay, hi, hello. If I start to cry, I don't think it's any of your business. Um, hi, it's Wanho time. It's honestly always Wanho time, I think. I think that's obvious. So let me be honest with you guys. I didn't watch the trailer. I watched the teaser because I wanted to surprise myself because over the years, there's, I don't, maybe like one or two times we've not watched the trailer, teaser, whatever they put out um, for, you know, the people we love. But I, I think the element of surprise that Wanho gives in his daily life really transfers to his musical life, which those obviously intertwine for him and for most people. But the surprise, like the element of surprise and like the expect the unexpected with Wanho is one of the best thrills of life. It's like a roller coaster. It's one of like, it's a good experience. It's like you're at an amusement park. You have no clue what's gonna happen, but you're gonna have a good time. I think for this, this comeback, now the last one, his, his, his debut was just like, you could, you could just see the happiness in just him putting out music again and seeing fans again. So I think this one is kind of like, like that one was like his comeback and he's back and it's sweet Wanho and it like still is sweet Wanho forever. But this is like, this is going to be like, like badass Wanho. Do you get what I mean? I hate using that word because it's kind of like, eh, but like, he's always like that. But this is kind of like, guess who's back? Back again. Wanho's back. Tell everybody, including your dogs and your aunt, grandmother, uncles, anyone. Really tell everyone because there's no doubt in my mind this is going to be... Just very unique, very Wanho. Who can do it like Wanho? No one. He is the, he is his own blueprint. He made the, he makes the, the bones of his music and the bones of his musical house were created by him. He laid the foundation, all of it. It's all just done by him. And it's very unique and very him. And I think not only the music that he makes, but the way he brings himself forward in his appearance and stuff while he makes the music is very him as well. You get what I mean. And I also think like the pride surrounding him being back in general for me and for people who have been there for a very long time or not for whoever you could have been here for a week, maybe a day. But for me being here since the very beginning, the very, very, very beginning, seeing him here happy doing music is, <laughs> it means a lot, it means a lot means a lot to me and to a lot of other people I know that and it's very um and in, it induces pride <laughs> it's like a shot of pride so now we're watching the lose music video not reluctantly I'm excited I'm always like oh I'm afraid hell no I'm excited I know he's about to do his thing but I don't even know what his thing is because he really switches it up on us let's turn this bitch up and let's let's watch Sexy time. And I haven't even seen any of this yet because I didn't watch the teaser. The way he's whew, svelte, svelte, very silky in the water, the water. You know, the water is very reminiscent of a performance I've seen him in water before. Oh, it's building. <laughs> oh, he's building up. He's gonna build up the music. Yo! Lord, I'm not religious, but God is good and God is real and God is Wanho. <laughs> that's just your body. And that's your, your body while you're doing the performance is that. It's all the time. That... Very EDM built sounds that he brings into his sexual, sexy music. And just because of, that jacket's amazing. Just because of the music sounding one way doesn't always mean the lyrics are gonna be like that. And he does that a lot. Where you're like, why am I crying? But you have a sh no shirt on. Like there's two meanings to this, to this sadness. One's good, one's bad. Only one thing left to say to you. Here he goes. Big, big, big arms. I love those arms that connect to the shoulders and it connects in it to the neck. I love his, in his neck. His, are we, listen to that.
that voice. You, you. It's the longing. He gives it and takes it right back. Now that's an outfit. He, if he's going to do one thing, it's going to be have 37 outfits and every single one's going to be hot. But he does more than one thing. That's the thing about him. <gasps> that's sick with the coming through the... Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, that, and I think I did it. I think he did it with that one. And what does it being in chains mean? And he's going to break out of the chains break out of those chains. That's the outfit with the pant leather pants, the black shirt, and it's raining. Um, wah. And I'm Italian. Yo, yo. Who is it? Well, you are Wanho. You are Wanho and you are... He's like a superhero. No. He is... I don't... He would... Who? He would be hired as a superhero, but they wouldn't need to do any work. They wouldn't need to say, go work out for a year and we'll see you again. He'd say, I'm ready to go now. I'm ready to rock. I'm down to clown. <laughs> okay. 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 So that was the video. You know what is a fun, you know what I think is a fun thing? You know what I think is fun about that? We are all home and I'm, and I, I have a, and I was just having a house party with him. And the thing is, is that if, uh, we don't need to leave our house to have a good time with Juan Ho because Juan Ho brings the good time home to us. So that's just, you're just, you know what I'd like to say also, I'd like to say I appreciate the staff who did the captions or whoever did it, staff, a fan, I don't know. I mean, the staff are fans, but do you know what I mean? The people behind the scenes who did, who did the captions so I could understand what was happening and they never, they never have to do that. It's appreciated whenever it happens. If it doesn't happen, it's fine. Do you know what I mean? But seeing it then when it dropped and understanding it, it it made me appreciate the song more. And I don't I don't not appreciate it when I don't have lyrics off the bat, but it, it just makes you be able to connect things easier when you can't speak fluently. If you think of it like sports, and I will, and I'm gonna think of it like sports, because he looks like, first of all, hi, the WWE could hire him to, yesterday, tomorrow. He's in. He's ready to rock. Um, if you think of it like there's like the minor leagues, major leagues, there's several leagues, but like Wanho has his own. Do you know what I mean? Like everyone's always like, he's in his own league. No, he literally is. He actually is because you can see the influence physically, musically, confident wise, confidence wise of him coming back and putting out music again and stuff like that, you can see the influence he has on other people and their music and things that were put out in the past that he was also a part of, that that influence is very prevalent in groups that are brand new and coming out with new stuff. And I think he really, I won't say paved the way because I don't like that phrase. I think that he was one of the pioneers for a very specific style of music in K-pop and a, a style that encompasses the physicality and the musicality of it and the mentality and all the alities come together to make what Wanho does. And I just think he has a very special talent. I think you can see how hard he works and how grateful he is literally just by like looking at his eyes and looking at what he's doing. And especially if you think of like what went on behind the scenes and how like courteous he is and all that type of stuff that it just makes you really love and appreciate him and what he does even more and I just think that there's no other man like him no no one looks like that you are one of a kind quite literally actually whenever it's like oh it's such a unique no he like there's you know he doesn't have a doppelganger he's one that's a one that's one guy you are solo living you're solo existing no one else is existing like this especially I mean someone might look like him but no one's performing like him no one's living like him. No one's existing like him. And that's that. So I love On Home. I love Blues. See you guys soon. And I'm going to listen to the whole album. So I want Home forever. Bye.